Hi, my name is Matthew Dixon, and this is a video for Rotary Club members. I advocate for people with mental illness in developing countries. Some countries have only one psychiatrist per million people, and they estimate about 270 million people in developing countries have no mental health care. What's worse is that some people with mental illness are actually kept in chains. This, they estimate that there are hundreds of thousands of people in the situation in about 60 countries around the world. I'm reaching out to you because as Rotary members, you may be interested in helping out with this. I've reached out to Pavel Repo of Fine Mind. He's helping people get basic mental health care in northern Uganda in Agago district. And he's collaborated with some of the Rotary clubs where he lives in Colorado in the U.S. And they've partnered with a host Rotary club in Uganda. What they've done is they've worked with Forrest Whitaker, the actor uh, recently in Star Wars. And he has a foundation, uh, the Whitaker Peace and Development Initiative, WPDI. And what they've done is they've allowed for 100 women to get some business skills to start a business as well as get mental health counseling at the same time. Pavel Repo, with his Fine Mind organization, he, it's, it's relatively small, and I found five other nonprofits, six in total, that are helping people get basic mental health care. Compared to other causes, like clean water, for example, clean water has armies of people uh, helping, uh, helping in developing countries. They, and yet even they, they need much more help than they're getting. Mental health care in developing countries, they, the people helping, they're few and far between. My website, mindaid.ca, M-I-N-D-A-I-D.ca, on that page under the donate section, I steer people towards these six nonprofits. It's, it's something dear to my heart. I, the whole time I went through mental illness, my heart went out to people in, in poverty, in war-torn countries who have mental illness to go through as well. I, I went through mental illness in Canada with one of the better healthcare systems in the world, although it needs a lot more health, uh, it needs a lot more improvement. Yet I felt like I was living in a war zone. The mental illness just itself is so incredibly difficult. If you haven't gone through it, it, it might be hard to understand. I know when I was healthy the first 20 years of my life before I got sick, I don't know if I could have understood how difficult mental illness can be and how not just mental illness uh, life in general some things can really be incredibly difficult i i knew life could be bad i knew you could lose your legs you could go blind but having never gone through anything like that before i, I didn't understand the difficulty of it the the pain the torment that some things in this life can 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 do to you so some other brand names or some other brand names, big names that have partnered with some of these six nonprofits. Bill Clinton, he, he endorses Partners for Health. That's one of the six nonprofits, as well as Arcade Fire, the, the rock band. And Ashley Judd, the actress, she's done a promotional video narrating it for Strong Minds, one of the other nonprofits. Riot Games, they've created the massively popular video game League of Legends. And in 2017, they donated a million dollars to Basic Needs. Basic Needs, uh, a few years ago, merged with CBM UK. And but to get to get those kind of names behind those small nonprofits, that's that makes me so happy. That makes me incredibly happy, because I I believe if people simply knew about this, if this was mainstream conversation. Most of the people I talk to don't know about people being kept in chains or that some countries have one psychiatrist per million people. And when I tell them that, they say, really? I, I didn't know that. I believe if people knew that, if it, was, if it was all over the news and people were talking about it like people are talking about mental illness today, I think so many people would want to help. My website, mindy.ca, is kind of a hub for the cause. It's, it's, it, I don't have much traction right now. It's, I've, I've had the website up for three years. I've had little impact. I'm hoping that as the years go on that I'll be able to say that I've raised or helped raise millions of dollars for the cause and given millions of people some basic mental health care. I would love to be able to say that. And I've had to watch my own 
health, my own mental health. I'm trying to tackle things that years ago I couldn't even contemplate tackling. And in the last three years, I've got my website up. I'm on Facebook, LinkedIn, and YouTube. I've uh, archived a bunch of videos on YouTube for the cause. I've tried to make my website a bit of a hub and uh, not a, I don't go into depth in a lot of things. I try to bring together the main the main aspects of the cause, the main areas where people are doing work. Because when I first started researching it, I found a lot of the things were scattered across the web. So it's a, it's a simple one-page website, and I've tried to uh, tried to assimilate uh, things there for people. So if any of you are interested in helping out, you can contact me at e uh, my my email is info at minday.ca. Uh, that's you can read you can go on my website minday.ca and find me there or on my social media channels. Email might be the the best way to get a hold of me. And if you want to reach out to Pavel Repo, the founder of Mind A, uh, Find Mind, he he would probably be glad to talk to you about the the Rotary clubs that he's been reaching out to. I I made this video because I, I I'd love to uh, speak to your to your uh, speak at your meetings. I know you're you are sometimes looking for presenters, and if you'd like me to present at your meeting, please I I'd, I'd love to do that. If uh, if it doesn't work out because of availability or time zones, that sort of thing, I'm hoping that this video is enough for you to give uh, a brief overview of the cause, what I'm trying to do, and things that you might be able to do too. Thanks so much, and enjoy your day.